final communique. The authority of heads of state and government of the Economic Community of West African States convened in an extraordinary session in Abuja, Nigeria on 10th August 2023 under the chairmanship of His Excellency Bola Ahmed Tinubu, President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria and Chair of the ECOWAS Authority. The extraordinary summit was convened as a sequel to the recent one held on 30 July 2023, following the illegal detention of President Mohamed Bazoum by the members of the Presidential Guard in the Republic of Niger on 26 July 2023. Present at the summit were the following heads of state and duly mandated representatives. His Excellency Patrice Talon, President of the Republic of Benin. His Excellency Alassane Ouattara, President of the Republic of Côte d'Ivoire. His Excellency Nana Ado Dankwa Akufo Ado, President of the Republic of Ghana. His Excellency Umaru Sisoko Mbalo, President of the Republic of Guinea-Bissau. His Excellency Bola Ahmed Tinubu, President of the Republic of Nigeria. His Excellency Maki Sal, President of the Republic of Senegal. His Excellency Julius Madabio, President of the Republic of Sierra Leone. His Excellency For Nyasimbe, President of the Togolese Republic. The authority having considered the memorandum presented by the President of the ECOWAS Commission on the current situation in the Republic of Niger, as well as ECOWAS engagement since the last extraordinary summit, and having considered the reports of the envoys of the Chair to Niger and various other places, carefully considered the report and recommendations of the ECOWAS Committee of Chiefs of Defense Staff, extensively discussed the latest development in Niger since the last extraordinary summit held on 30th July 2023, noted that all diplomatic efforts made by ECOWAS in resolving the crisis have been defiantly repelled by the military leadership of the Republic of Niger, Taking note of the expiration of the one-week ultimatum given for the restoration of constitutional order in the Republic of Niger, decide as follows. A. Reiterates its strong condemnation of the attempted coup d'etat and the continued illegal detention of President Mohamed Bazoum, his family, and members of his government. B. Further condemns the, con the condition in which President Bazoum is being detained and hold the CNSP fully and solely responsible for the safety, security, and physical in integrity of President Bazoum, members of his family and government. C. Uphold all measures and principles agreed upon by the extraordinary summit held on Niger on 30th July 2023 underscore the determination of the ECOWAS authority to keep all options on the table for the peaceful resolution of the crisis. Enforce all measures, in particular border closures and strict travel bans and assets freeze, on all persons or groups of individuals whose actions hinder all peaceful efforts aimed at ensuring the smooth and complete restoration of constitutional order. One member states who, by their action directly or indirectly, hindered the peaceful resolution of the crisis in Niger about the consequences for their action before the community. Call on the African Union to endorse all the decisions taken by the ECOWAS authority on the situation in Niger. Further call on all partner countries and institutions, including the United Nations, to support ECOWAS in its effort to ensure a quick restoration of constitutional order in conformity with its normative instruments.
direct the President of the Commission to monitor the implementation of the sanctions. Direct the Committee of the Chief of Defense Staff to activate the ECWA standby force with all its elements immediately. Order the deployment of the ECOWAS standby force to restore constitutional order in the Republic of Niger. Underscore its continued commitment to the restoration of constitutional order through peaceful means. <laughs> 